Hi, this is Rob with Longevity Learning Lab. I've got the innovator here. It's the 255i. It's a four process welder. It's got the TIG, the stick, it's ACDC, and it's got a plasma cutter. That's pretty cool. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and I'll show you what we got here, all the equipment, and uh, then I'll set it up as we go. And uh, there's quite a bit here, so I'm going to make it in maybe two videos, maybe three. But uh, what I like about it is the fact that all of our plugs are now compatible. We got nice bigger plugs and everything should fit right on in. And uh, I like that, a little bit more durable. And so, yeah, let me go ahead, we'll start with the arc welding, the stick welding first. Show you how to set up the machine, where all the, the fittings are. And uh, yeah, we'll be right back. Okay, here it is. Here's the front of the unit. And we're just gonna do the arc welding first on this, this show. Okay, so in the back you got your on-off switch and your cord and your fitting for your, your airline, whether it's the, the, your gas or the airline for the plasma. It's all the same. So then we'll go ahead. Let me zoom in on the, the front of the, the unit here and I'll show you where the connections and all that go for our stick welding and really all the other, the, all the other leads too. Okay, here's our control panel. Now as you can see, we've got the different settings off to the, the top left and it, it, the one arrow it says the TIG, the stick, and the plasma. So now it's set on TIG, so we want to change that and we'll go ahead and we'll change it down to the stick setting. Okay, see it blinking like that? Okay, so now we know it's on the, the uh, stick welding. So then on this side over here, it's set for AC, so we want to change it down to the DC. Now you don't really have to worry about any of the other controls because we're just doing the stick welding. So what we do here now, go to our amperage control and we'll go ahead, we want to set our amperage. And then you can also, you program it too. So say we got the program one, so then we'll get, say the amperage will go up to 150 because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to strike some, thin, uh, some thick material. Okay, so we'll go up to 150. And then you want to just, you hold that button and that'll set your program for one. You hold it and then the one will start blinking. So now, whenever you want that setting, you just go right to that program and uh, it's already set up for you. That's, that's the, it'll do that thinking for you. So now, you're ready to go ahead and set up the leads for your, for your uh, stick welding. So let me go ahead and I'll get that going on for you and then we'll go ahead and run a bead. Okay, now here we got our, our connectors. Now we don't have to worry about the gas. We don't have to worry about the plug. And then the little ground, we don't have to worry about because that's, that's just for the plasma cutter anyway. Okay, so all we are concerning ourselves with is the stinger. Okay, the stinger will go over here on the negative end and lock in. And then our ground cable will go on the other side. Head up and through here. Lock it in. Now we're ready to go ahead and do some welding. So let me get that going on for you. Okay, now we got it set up for the, the stick welding. So, you got your ground. Just keep it on your table right there. Then the clamp, these clamps are nice, nice and heavy clamps. And then we'll run a quick little, little bead. That starts up pretty nice. This is just a 7018 rod, and uh, it burns nice and clean. That could have gone a little hotter. This is half inch material, but uh, it turns out okay. Here, I'll do a little fillet weld here.
Seems like a little guy will go all day long. Well, there's your arc welding there. Now let's clean this up a little better here. A little bit of splatter. I'm not the best welder in the world, but there you go. That's one down. Let's go on to the TIG welding. Well, there's your arc welding end of it. So now what we're going to do is uh, we'll set it up for the TIG welding on the next episode because that's going to be a little bit longer one. This one here I wanted to get out, out of the way first. And this is a nice unit so far. I can't wait to get to the plasma. And uh, I'm Rob and we'll see you on part two, Longevity Learning Lab. See ya.